are you hoping for uh, in, in the new pope who was voted? Probably a stronger one with uh, stronger convictions, one that'll stand up and sort of like dictate and uh, try and make the world a better place, of course. And I'd like it to see one from Canada. I'm excited, of course, and I'm just hoping and praying that today, uh, whoever are assigned to choose the, you know, an ex pope will be guided and uh, have the wisdom to choose the, the, you know, appropriate ones. That's all I've been praying for. All Christians pray every day for that God will guide us and the church. And uh, so today was special because they're actually in the conclave, and all the speculation has to stop because there will be a result and we'll be glad to hear it. And we'll love whoever it is that they choose. We have to meditate and we have to pray uh, in behalf of those in the conclave that the one that will be elected will be chosen by God, the successor of St. Peter. Somewhere amongst that group of about 117 individuals is an extraordinary man who will be called upon <laughs> to uh, to something very, very unique and, and, and hopefully timely, you know, to, to energize the world to, uh, to greater things.